Hello, M0MSN, Mike's the name. And uh, who knew something so simple to set up was going to be so difficult to explain and to show how to do. Um, you know, it's taken me, oof, must be two to three days now of uh, constantly recording and then deleting and then recording a bit more just to show you how to set up to run a Pi Star hotspot. You can buy these already assembled or as a, uh, a top for a Pi. Um, zero. Um, I bought mine already uh, assembled and already programmed actually. The operating system was already on it. All I needed to do was add my DMR um, ID uh, and plug it in. Um, oh, I did have to add the, the Wi-Fi code for my, uh, for my house. Uh, however, if it arrives as a kit or arrives um, um, without uh, the pre-programming um, you need to program it, you need to install an operating system and set it up. So navigate to pi-star.uk. Um, here you will um, be able to download the um, the operating system. Um, now you'll have to look up the, the specific uh, type of operating system you require for your hotspot uh, and download it. Um, and then you will need to um, also download the, the Wi-Fi configuration. Um, so you navigate basically to uh, the PyStar tools, uh, into uh, the Wi-Fi builder and input your house or Wi-Fi information um, and then hit the, uh, the download button. And that sends a configuration file to your downloads on your computer. Um, once you have both the uh, the download for the Wi-Fi and also the operating system, you then need to go to uh, yet another website. Um, I think I'm using, um, is it Etch, Etch something, I don't know. Uh, I download the, uh, the installer. It's uh, basically an SD card writer. Um, you run the program you find the program you want to install on your SD card and, and then basically hit start and it will write the operating system for the Pi Star to the SD card. Once the operating system is installed on the SD card, you then open it in another window and drag and drop the configuration file for your Wi-Fi onto the root of the card directory. When it is copied across, you close the window, remove the SD card and insert it into the Pi Star. Power the Pi Star up Wait a few minutes. This can literally take up to five or six minutes for this uh, to uh, to boot for the very first time. You may be lucky to get a reasonably uh, quick um, Pi Zero, in which case it will take no more than a minute. And once booted, um, you will, will you will not have a screen working. Okay, this is, does not come switched on by default. It is a blank screen by default. Um, you need to open a web browser and type in pi-star.local in the browser address bar and hit return. Now, if you've entered the um, your Wi-Fi details correctly onto the Pi Star, it would have attached itself to your network. And by typing that URL into your um, computer's browser, you will interface with the Pi Star's built-in um, website. Once you're on that particular website, um, it will tell you that it's not configured to be anything particularly. Um, you then click through to the next page and start configuring the Pi Star. The very first thing you have to do um, is tell it what it is. And that's simply by applying 
the very, very top paragraph. So the top paragraph would tell you um, that it's a, a Pi Star NW, whatever, um, and you just click apply. That tells the Pi Star that it, you need it to be active. It will reboot, come back to life, and then you'll have a, a selection of toggle switches that allow you to turn on DMR, turn on the Yesu um, system fusion, turn on other type of digital interfaces, and also turn on the screen so that you can see the Pi Star has booted. And um, when it comes to life, it will tell you on the screen what's happening. Once you've toggled all of those to the, uh, the on position, click apply. The Pi Star will again reboot and then come back to life. Once it's done that, you can then put in your DMR ID, your call sign, your location, and uh, other bits and pieces required for the, for the Pi Star um, side of things. Then hit apply. And again, your Pi Star will turn itself off, then reboot, then come to life. Um, this time, hopefully, with the screen working. Um, and that's pretty much it. You're ready to rock and roll. One thing I did forget to mention, you can get your um, Pi Star ID um, from the, this website. There you go. I have Charlie Tango 1, Delta Lima, Charlie Tango 2, Foxtrot Zulu John, Charlie Sierra 7, Alpha X-Ray Golf, Charlie Tango 2, Hotel United, uh, um, in, <laughs> in, it's my mind right now. I'm Charlie Sierra 7, Alpha Papa Zulu, Charlie Tango 1, Delta Lima, uh, Papa, let's see. I think that's it. Okay, that's it for the first call. Let's do a second call for Portugal. Please come now. Charlie Tang 1, Echo Mike Uniform, 73. Portugal, no traffic to the net. Thank you. Charlie Tango 2, Juliet, Alpha Whiskey, 73. Charlie Tango 1, 